Welcome to the Yes Room, a place where we get to meet our successful Shark Tank entrepreneurs. I'm here with Scott, who just received a yes for his big idea, the Heg Peg. Welcome. Thank you very much. How are you feeling? It's incredible. I tell you what, it was, I had to hold back and I just wanted to go, yes. So I just felt like that and I just had to be calm and collective, so it was very exciting for me, yeah. Talk to me about your yes moment when you first came up with the idea of the Heg. Sure. It's a strange story. It is. And uh, when I opened this one, it's like I start with a dress and they go, what? Um, so, yeah, it was a black dress and it had two straps on it. And I walked outside and I thought, how am I going to put this up without any line marks, sun marks or peg marks? And I looked up and I thought if there was a hook on that peg, I could just hook it up by the straps. And I went, yes, that's what I want to do. Going into the tank, did you think you were going to get a deal or do you think it was, did you think it was a bit dicey? To be honest, I thought I would. I thought I'd get the yes because it's an innovative idea. It's Australian made, uh, it's going to be going global and it doesn't exist on the shelf so yeah, I was hoping it would be a yes. I look back at the day a year and a half ago a little bit more when people went, what? <laughs> they go, a peg on a hook, okay good luck with that. And now they're actually going, wow, they can't believe we're actually, I think it's to do with the brand, the Heg. It's new, it's innovative, uh, it doesn't exist. We're ranked number one in the world on Google now for those four letters. We're actually becoming a brand and that's really important and that was sort of in my head the day that I stood out there putting that black garment up. You're a bloke who is full of big ideas and you don't like taking no for an answer. No, I don't. No, there was a time actually in Alice Springs where I decided to put an ice skating rink in the middle of Alice Springs in the middle of summer. And we did it. We built it. We put 15,000 people on it in six weeks. And also there was Indigenous kids who would never get the chance to do that in their whole entire life. So, no, I don't. I'm, I'm absolutely all about yes. What sort of advice would you give other people who have a dream or an idea and they, and they want to bring it to fruition? Go through the process. You know, it's a matter of go, why do you want to do it and go through the idea and talk to people and get through no man's land and figure out how and innovate and why is it different. Then make an executive decision on if you want to continue. But get there first, you know, and then make it. It's really important because I, I would love to do a study on the amount of ideas that come out and don't go anywhere because people have said no. We should be saying yes, that's the point behind it. All right, Scott, thank you very much for sharing your yes story with us. Thank and you we know much. that Heg is going to be a roaring success. Can't wait. This yes moment brought to you by Optus. Optus says yes to.